FNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update, and currently we have a bit of a mixed bag out here. The Dow up 117, and transports are up 42. The other industries are trading to the downside. The Dow, the s and off 19, the NASDAQ 183, Russell's off 8, semis are down 48. You've got gold trading off $9.50, 1975.20 is the print there. Silver's off 29 cents, 25.74. Lights we grew is up 2 bucks, and the 30-year Treasury is down 2 ticks, I'm sorry, 2 points and 9 ticks, trading out at 140.29. Let's go spend a little time with our indice charts out here let's go see what kind of messages we can grab from them in the upper left hand corner you've got the dow what does the dow have it's got a valid td9 count bottom price is above its green oscillator and change line and that says that, well, first, if it can clear, now I'm not talking about today, but if it can clear its recent high from about three or four days ago, that's at the 34,908 level. If price can clear that, we're headed up to 35,201. Its message right now is bullish, valid bottom, and price above a green oscillator unchanged line. Those are bullish conditions. The S&P 500 has a valid bottom, TD9 count. Price is targeting its oscillator unchanged line. That's at 44.74. If price can clear that, then you're looking at 46.03 to the upside. If price negates its TD9 count, you're looking at 42.51 to the downside. NASDAQ 100, TD9 count bottom. Oscillator unchanged line at change color. Price and that line should catch up to each other. That I or the oscillator unchanged line is printing at 14,348. If the TD9 count were to fail, price would go target 13,475. Russell 2000, not a whole lot for me to comment here. It's not that it doesn't have a valid top or bottom. It's just been trading in a sideways consolidation. Uh, but if it can close above that red oscillator and change line, which is currently priced at uh, 20... 23, that would be a bullish outcome. The semis, they've got a TD9 count bottom. That will remain in place unless price takes out the low from April the 12th out there. Price should target its oscillator and change line. That's in the 3170 level. Transports, no bottoming pattern or signal out here, but price still may be targeting 15071. The New York Stock Exchange, valid TD9 count bottom. If price can close above 16,635.47, the New York Stock Exchange will be communicating to us it wants to head to 16,932. NASDAQ Composite, TD9 count bottom kind of get the message here what do we have eight charts six of the eight have got uh, valid bottoming patterns out here so we know what the market is attempting to do the question is will it do it stay tuned folks your favorite polar bear david white's up next tom o'brien to take us on home have a fantastic holiday weekend i'll look forward to seeing you again one o'clock sharp on monday afternoon take care of you soon